The placement of Interstate 244 uh, was built right in the heart of the Greenwood community. The resurge, the rebuilt, the revitalized Greenwood community that was destroyed in the race mask of 1921. And the placement was very strategic. Not only did they bulldoze through North Tulsa, but they didn't even put an exit ramp. No exit ramp off of arguably one of the most popular streets in Oklahoma, if not the country. Um, there's no exit ramp. That was done by design to kill the businesses that were here um, and to relocate the people. Every time an 18-wheeler goes across the interstate, our windows shake. <laughs> the, the, the Department of Transportation has greatly caused the deterioration of our stained glass windows and our church because every time something that's heavy goes across the interstate, our church shakes and it moves. The ones that had cracks in them, they put them back together. Um, they, clean, they clean all of them off because you can imagine like a hundred years worth of dirt and grime just festering on the windows. Um, and, and, and thankfully the company that we purchased the windows from back in the 1920s is still in existence today. And so they were able to find the same company, the same material glass and all that stuff. We still have a lot more to do. Wow. That is so cool. Can I touch them? We have a lot more uh, restoration we need done. Uh, and, I, and I tell people, you know, it's kind of like having a 115-year-old grandmother and trying to get her to look like she did back when she was in her 30s, you know. That's going to take a lot of cosmetic work, you know. And so we, that, that times a thousand for this building is what we are endeavoring to do. I gave it a kiss and it didn't crack, you know, so it's good. I love it. You kiss things you love, and I love it. It is incredible. It is incredible, and I'm thankful to God um, um, and, and this community, right, that has supported the mission of restoring the grandmother of Greenwood. And back home, like somebody coming home from the hospital. That's right. You know, I see you.